Hi guys, Tech James here. In this video, I will be showing you guys how to install Sony's official theme packs on your PSP or PS Vita. So I will be using my PSP 1000 in this video, but this does also work on the Adrenaline emulator if you have a PlayStation Vita. So all you guys want to do is just go ahead and connect your PSP or your PS Vita to your PC using USB connection. Alright guys, so over on your computer, I will leave a link to PSP Scene Beta in the description. There's just one thing you need to know, you must have an account if you wish to download stuff off this website. But obviously it's free to make an account and it takes about 5 seconds. But once you have an account, you will be able to download these themes. So it says up here, Sony's official PSP themes. I'm not too sure um, if they, maybe they were the themes that you could uh, buy off the shop at one point. I'm not 100% sure. But anyway, it gives us some really cool themes that we can download for our PSP or for Adrenaline over on the PS Vita. So if you guys scroll down, there's a few pictures, but these are actually all of the links that we can click to download the themes. Now, if you want to see what the themes are like in each pack, you can actually just click on preview and you can see. So this pack right here has all of these themes in. So I'm going to download this one right now. And there's a few other weird ones. Let's just get some random ones as well. It does say they're all official. So yeah, I assume these are off the store. And there's also some like um, separate themes. These are just custom themes all by themselves. So I've downloaded two packs right here. You guys can download as many packs as you want. It's entirely up to you. Themes really do not take up much storage. So once you've downloaded them, you want to head over to your pieces downloads folder and just find your theme packs in here. So what I'm going to do is just select the packs, right click and then select like extract here. So if it gives you two text documents, you can delete them. All we need is the PSP folder and then inside of the theme folder. So simply go onto your PSP or PS Vita. If it's PS Vita, you need to go inside the PSP MU folder. But once you're inside of there, you can find PSP and simply drag and drop the theme folder across. So it should literally take two seconds to copy everything. And now we can just see. And as you guys can see, all of my custom themes are on here or some of these are official so yeah now we're going to go back onto my PSP and I will just show you guys what they look like and how to apply them. Okay so once you're back on your PSP what I'm going to do is just show you guys where the themes are and how to apply them so just press back on this message and what we are looking for is just the theme settings right here so just press X on that now we can go up to theme and just press on X and now here are all the themes which we got so I think some of these are official, like ones you could get off the shop, and then some of these are custom made. Um, this Wipeout Fusion one, where is it? This one right here. This one's actually pretty cool, and this is official, so to apply it, simply just press X, and then X on Apply, and then X on Yes, and then it will apply the custom theme for you. So as I said, these do work in Adrenaline as well, which is pretty cool, so you can customize your Adrenaline and get that looking a lot cooler. So yeah, I, I really like this theme. I'm pretty sure this is official, because it's very well made. Let's see some of the other themes we've got on here just quickly. Um, there are some pretty cool ones. Let's apply, let's see what we've got, a Spider-Man theme. Let's just see what this looks like. So this one does actually look official as well. So that does actually look pretty cool. Right. This is either official or someone's just, um, you know, put a lot of effort into it. Let's just have a look at some of the other themes we have got. Theme settings, theme. Um, what else do it come with? Of course there's lots on there you guys can choose and um, there's probably some really good ones on there as well And there's also a Soul Calibur one. Let's just put this on So yeah, that is pretty much it for this video This is how you get custom theme packs on your PSP and all of them do actually look pretty cool So if you guys enjoyed make sure to like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one